Hey guys, so I've been thinking about doing an unhaul video for a while now, and I think I have a good collection of books here that I'm ready to get rid of. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just get into it. A lot of these I haven't read and I've just lost interest in them. Uh, so let me know if you have read them and you think I should actually give them a chance. So let's just hop right in. I'm gonna go pretty quick because there is a lot. So Montana Rose by Mary Connealy. I believe I did read that one, but it is a, uh, I think it's like a, I think it's modern day romance. Anyway, we were gonna go quick, weren't we? Um, the Promise by Jane Part, the American Quilt series. Never read that one. We've got The Englisher by Beverly Lewis. Uh, we've got A Stitch in Time by Alison Boltzky. Boltzky? Ugh. I'm trying to make this a quick video and now I'm just sabotaging myself. The When Come. When Comes the Spring by Jeanette Oak. I actually haven't read any of these books, but I did watch the TV series and I've watched some of the movies. Uh, a Christmas Sleigh Ride by Tracy V. Bateman and Jill something. Um, I've got two from the Yada Yada Prayer Group by Netta Jackson. Never read those ones. Um, the Prophet by Francine Rivers. I did start this one, but I no longer am interested in biblical fiction, so I'm going to get rid of that one. We've got Consider Lily by Anne Dayton and Mae Vanderbilt. Uh, Lisa Sampson, Straight Up. A Kiss for Cade by Laurie Copeland. I did read that one. I don't really remember anything about it. Uh, a Lady Like Sarah, A Rocky Creek Romance. So you can tell some of the ones that I have read are uh, The Measure of a Lady by Deanne Gist. This one I got when I worked at a bookstore. So that's why it's an advanced reader's copy. Um, yeah, so a lot of them are romantic fiction and I don't really read too much of that anymore. Um, we've got the trilogy, The Lassoud in Texas trilogy by Mary Connealy. We've got The Beach House by Sally John. And then we have like, seriously guys, look at this. I'm so not going through every one of these books, but I've got a lot of these. Um, most of them are these love inspired, just little tiny trade paperback books. And I have read all of these back when I was uh, more into I guess romantic fiction. So let's do this. And then another stack. I used to pick these up all the time at the thrift store as well as I used to have a monthly subscription to that uh, many years ago. And then we've got some more of my recent reads. Um, so you all know that I'm getting rid of Illuminate and Obsidio because I don't do zombie type stories. So there's that. The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern because it was a little bit too dark magic. I'm getting rid of A Cherokee Rose by Alan Joanna Lacey because I was halfway through the book and I still hadn't met Cherokee Rose and I, that's the story I was wanting to read. So we're gonna get rid of that one. We're getting rid of Graceling by Kristen Cashore. This one started off really good. It was really interesting and then about halfway or three quarters, um, there was an intimate scene that made me a bit uncomfortable. So getting rid of that one. Uh, the Reading Room, Whispers in the Reading Room. I got this from a book outlet haul. Uh, I don't know if you remember that, but by Shelley Gray. I'm getting rid of this one because it was boring and very formulaic. And then I've got um, The Mysterious Benedict Society because I ended up finding the box set at the thrift store. So um, I didn't need the single book anymore. Um, Room of Marvels by James Bryan Smith. I haven't read this one before. 
I'm getting rid of um, part two, The Two Towers of the Lord of the Rings, because this is a movie cover edition, and I, I'm just not interested in the movie cover editions. I like all the other art, art styles of the other ones, I guess. And then the last three, uh, I've got Flowers for Algernon by Daniel Keyes. I've got Blue Like Jazz by Donald Miller. And then lastly, Of Mice and Men by John Steinbeck. So this is my unhaul. Um, I know there's a lot. I know I went fast. I went fast specifically because most of them I haven't read. Well, most of this from here down I basically haven't read. And then I didn't go through those because they're basically all the same. And then I went through these. So that is my unhaul. Um, if any of my friends and family um, who are nearby are watching this video and you want one of these, let me know. Otherwise, they will be going to the thrift store. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye!